Trenton police want to find a driver they are calling dangerous. Investigators tell us Jacob Anderson hit and hurt two people, including seriously injuring a Portland police officer. That was Sunday while they say he was escaping in a stolen truck. And they say Anderson has wavy hair. You see a couple pictures of him here on your screen, but he has been known to shave it to change his appearance. So if you see him, make sure you call 911. And Coin6 found out Anderson is not only wanted in Multnomah County. He has warrants out of Benton, Lincoln, and Clackamas counties and was arrested just last month on serious charges. We wanted to know why wasn't he being held in jail? We sent Elise Haas to find out. And what did you discover, Elise? Well, Jeff, like you outlined, it was this weekend he hit and hurt people with his car. And we've also learned that just a month ago, police here in Portland arrested him for almost the exact same thing. On June 29th, uh, Jacob Anderson ran into another car and a tree, and that's when police first took him into custody. And at that time, they arrested and cited him for the following, including driving under the influence, reckless endangering, reckless driving, possession of a controlled substance and felon in possession of a firearm. His full criminal history, however, is serious and very lengthy, dating back to 2007. According to court documents from two weeks ago, Multnomah County Judge Stephen Bouchong signed off on releasing Anderson under his own recognizance. When we reached out to the DA's office, the Multnomah County District Attorney's Office said in a statement, we don't have a comment on Judge Stephen Bouchong's decision to release Jacob Anderson because it's their authority to make that decision. However, we do know that according to presiding judge order, Jacob Anderson's most recent offenses of DUI and reckless driving here in Portland do not meet the criteria of violent offenses that are required for holding someone in jail before their trial. I, of course, did reach out to Judge Bouchong asking him for a comment, but the courts got back to me and said that he will not be making a statement on this matter. But the Multnomah County Courts did confirm that they and authorities issued Clackamas County's warrant for arrest to Anderson the day that they released him from jail on July 14th. But they did want to make it clear that those other warrants for his arrest that you had mentioned, Jeff, from Benton and Lincoln counties had not been issued until after he had already been released from Multnomah County custody. Live in Southeast Portland, Elise Haas, Coin 6 News.